Sustainable Development Goal of the United Nations, which is decent work and economic growth. Globally, 61% of all workers are informally employed. Men earn 12.5% more than women in 40 out of 45 countries with data. So you might be wondering, what is the cause of this? Why does the problem of unequal pay still exist? One of these causes is discrimination and bias in hiring decisions. When companies make decisions that are related to hiring and paying employees, their decisions are often tinted with discrimination and biasness. Another cause is mothers taking time out of work to raise a family. Because women are childbearers, they often have to take maternal leave. Meanwhile, research has shown that fathers do not take maternal leave as often as mothers do. This also leads me to the next cause, which is lack of flexibility for mothers returning to work. When mothers do raise a family and want to return back to work, jobs lack that flexibility for the mother's life as a parent to blend in with her working life. Now let me give you some suggestions, which I call big solutions, that people in power can do in order to change the world and make it a better place to live in. One big solution is raise the minimum wage. Another big solution would be to enforce a law which requires company to pay their employees equally. Did you know that Iceland actually does have a law like this one? And companies that have 25 or more employees are required to pay their employees equally. Encourage shared parental leave and provide access for free childcare. This will allow mothers to go back to work more easily if they wish to do so. Ask companies to make their employees' wage transparent so that everyone knows how much their employees are getting paid and if they are getting paid unequally. Reflecting on that earlier thought of people in power helping change the world, you might be wondering what organizations are already helping. I know you know that UN is definitely changing the world, but let me list some others as well. These would be organizations such as UN Women, Fawcett Society, or ERA, Equal Rights Advocates. Now for my simple solutions. Ensure safe working conditions. If someone around you or one of your colleagues does not feel safe at work, help them and make them feel safer wherever they work. Encourage more job opportunities for youth and help initiate a bring your child to work day so that children can also see what a safe and healthy work environment looks like. I hope you learned so much from this video and you enjoyed it as well. For more videos like this one, please subscribe to our channel Connections to Build and to Build Well.